Okay, so if you need to activate your, enable your breakout rooms, this is how you do it. So you go to your Zoom account, make sure you're logged in, click on your little profile picture. So you're gonna grow, go to your profile. You're gonna click on settings. And breakout rooms are really, really awesome if you're teaching two different classes at once, or if you're doing a small group, or you wanna do group work. Um, things like that can really help if you want the whole group there and you want to pull a, a side group that can really help um, And if you have a really big class, you can kind of break it down But I'm gonna scroll down scroll down and it's a ways down here All the way down where it says breakout room and you want to make sure you enable this if it's gray It means it's not enabled if you have it here it is so it allow host to assign participant to breakout rooms when scheduling so that you can do ahead of time also which can be really really helpful and make it quicker so once i did that i can go to my meetings and i'm just going to start my fourth block meeting here to show you this i'm going to open zoom join with computer audio and then you have your breakout rooms icon down here now so when you click on this this is going to give you some different options to assign how many participants you want and how many rooms you want and you'll be able to move the students around I don't have any students in here right now so you can't see that but when you watch the other video that I have linked that's going to show you um, how to kind of create those rooms and how you can move students all right I hope that helps